What's up everybody, Fran Grams here, and today I feel like talking about what's next for Nintendo and more specifically the Switch 2, as a lot of people have been calling it, the launch title that I think is gonna launch with the next Nintendo console. So yeah, sit back, relax, and I guess just listen to me ramble on about my predictions for the Switch 2 and its launch title. Alright, so starting off with when I think the next Nintendo console is gonna drop, I believe it's most likely at the latest gonna be late 2024, which a lot of people have been saying because early 2024, that's really not that. It wouldn't make much sense because the Switch is still getting some big games like later this year, like Mario Wonder, Mario RPG. Those are the only ones I could think of off the top of my head. But the point is, I feel like Nintendo still wants to make the most out of their current console, so they're probably gonna take it into late next year. So, yeah. That's when I think the Switch 2 is releasing just like everybody else, late next year. I don't see anything else for the Switch that's been announced that would prolong its life any longer than that. So, okay. But what about when the Switch 2 or the Super Switch, which I've heard people mention, what about when it actually releases? What games is it going to come with? And I guess I would start off with my wishes. Like, I wish it would drop with the next Metroid Prime game, Metroid Prime 4. If you've been listening to a couple of my other videos, I mentioned that game quite a bit. But if not that, if I'm trying to be realistic here, I think it could drop with Metroid Prime 4. You see, I, I threw you for a loop there. But yeah, I guess realistically speaking, I don't see obviously Nintendo dropping a new Zelda game with the Switch 2. Nobody's thinking that. But then we just have Mario left. And... A new 3D Mario game only a year after a new 2D Mario game? Sure, it sounds possible, but why not offer a whole new experience? Maybe it's a new 3D Mario game in Metro Prime 4, but that would actually be crazy talk to think that could happen, in my opinion. So, yeah, right now, I believe it's more feasible for Metro Prime 4 over a new 3D Mario game. But other than that, I guess there's also your Mario Karts, like Mario Kart 9. But once again, if it wasn't for this DLC Nintendo's been pumping out for Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, sure, I would have definitely predicted Mario Kart 9, but I feel like they're trying to really just beat a dead horse with Mario Kart 8. And I say that, like, not in a negative way. I just don't know how else to say the fact that they want to probably prolong Mario Kart 8's life as much as they could. So there you go. I don't blame them. Say so Mario Kart 9, once again, I don't think it's that possible it could launch with that. And I'm just kind of going down the list here of possible games it could release with. Maybe a new Donkey Kong. We already have Mario vs. Donkey Kong, the minis game. But I, I just don't know. I'm trying to think of something big that could get people to buy the next Nintendo console. But that, like, I already ruled out two of some of the biggest franchises that could make that happen. And Metroid Prime, as much as, like, there's so many fans of it. I think, like, it sits right in the middle there, like, it's just, like, hidden in mystery enough to where people would be hyped if it was announced, but it's still not as big as the other franchises, in my opinion. I haven't seen as big of a fan base for that as, like, your Marios and Zeldas. So, yeah, I guess this video is just literally me pondering this, uh, this dilemma, like, what should I officially predict for the next Nintendo launch title? Let me know in the comments down below, like, what you think, because I'm really interested to see, like, what people who are actually more in tune with Nintendo and their release strategies have to say about this. But, yeah, that's my official prediction there. Oh, yeah, and another reason why I don't think a 3D Mario is that possible is because we're also getting the Thousand Year Door remake, remaster, and Super Mario RPG. So that's our Super Mario RPG, the Thousand Year Door, Super Mario Bros. Wonder, and a 3D Mario on the span of, like, a year or so? I don't know, that's just... Sounds less and less feasible to me. So if I'm going down like the list, Metro Prime 4 is my top prediction. Under that, maybe Mario Kart 9. Then maybe Splatoon 5, 6, whatever they're on now. But you see where I'm going? Let me know. Like I said, am I missing anything here? Am I going crazy? Are there other games out there that Nintendo has that they just haven't pulled out of their sleeve yet? But yeah, there we go. I mean, let's, I guess we'll just have to wait and see until next year. And we'll go back to this video and I guess just... Praise me for being able to predict it correctly.